and welcome. This is Melissa Armel with the Stock Swoosh. I'm just reviewing the options trades for yesterday that I called on December 1st. So uh, Tuesday was the first day of December and it started out extremely well. Every trade worked. Uh, with the options newsletter, you receive the trades that are get emailed to you. There is no prerequisites for the newsletter. I get a lot of questions. How many trades are there per week, per month, per year? This year I've caught an extraordinary amount of trades. Uh, it's well over 700 now, I think. It's a lot of trades, which means you'll have plenty of trades to do, and you don't even have to do them all, quite frankly, uh, because days like yesterday, uh, you, you may want to only do one or two, but if you do do them all on days like yesterday where I called them all, they all worked. It was a very profitable day. So the benefit is uh, if we get days like yesterday where I called everything but one ticker symbol with the market, you can have a huge day. And that occurred yesterday in the gap up I saw in the overall market. I saw that it would hold, I saw it would fall through. And how did I see that? By using my gap rating system. Now the gap rating system is what I teach in the Golden Gap course, but you don't have to do the Golden Gap course in order to subscribe to the Options the newsletter. It is only an annual subscription though. It is not uh, month to month, okay? So you have to sign up for the year. But let's just review these trades. Well, here was the totals first before I go over the trades. I called Netflix calls, Facebook calls, Q's calls, Spy calls, Zoom, two trades in the Zoom, which were puts, was the only puts, and then an Apple call. And this is an advanced risk in the trades, which I'll review in the trades here in a minute. Total profit, 40375 for the day. An average return on investment in these seven trades was 69%. So I usually say between 50 and 100% if you're looking to get out. If you can't watch the trade, you can put an order at 50 or 100%, see if you get filled. Uh, it's better, obviously, if you can watch what's going on. So that's really up to you and your schedule. There are a lot of people in the options newsletter, though, that have jobs full time and are doing other things and can't watch the trades all day. Uh, but then I do have people that are in the live trading room with me where I review the market in the room and then also go over what I think of the market and uh, where I think these things are going for the day. So I call the Netflix. And again, you see the time here was in the pre-market. So I called well, I call, I call a lot of trades, I think, in the morning before the market opens, but you can't take them until the market opens. So this was the 492.50 calls expiring 12.11. So that was, I gave this extra time. I didn't know if this would go immediately. This did. In fact, you could still be in this, um, but I, I might call another one in this, but it was a nice move. Uh, cost was $16. Five contracts. Risk is 8000 Again, this is an advanced risk. Sold at 22, profit 3,000, return on investment 38%. So sometimes if I call what I call a bucket, a bucket of trades all in one direction with the market on that day, you don't have to necessarily hold them overnight. If they all run up that day or run down if they're puts, you, you, you have to look at it like a bucket, boom, 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 and you take the profits in all of them, which as you can see is it was a lot of money. So anyways, this one would have worked uh, with a bigger return on investment if I had done the Fridays. If I'd done the 12 fours, but I honestly didn't know for sure this would go yesterday, but it did. So that was a nice move. Here is the Netflix from yesterday in the morning again in the pre-market. I called it, closed here, gapped up. I called this in the morning. I saw the gap up, called the 49250s, boom, took off, went. And 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 again, nice bullish move. I called the Facebook 280s. Again, this would call is expiring Friday. This had a beautiful move. Cost was 480, which was very reasonable. Again, an advanced risk, 9,600. 20 contracts sold at 10, profit $10,400. Return on investment, 108%. Here's the Facebook chart. Again, this was December 1st. Stock closed here, gapped up, boom, moved. Beautiful. And again, it ran through the strike, up beyond. Really, dream target was 290. It almost got there. It got pretty close. And actually, it had a secondary move today. You could have continued this up and held this through today. But I thought yesterday, again, with the market, was a good exit. And I also called the queues. QQQs were up yesterday in the morning. Again, all in the pre-market. Strike was 302, expiring Friday. And you got to keep in mind these expiration dates, too, when you're exiting. Cost was 225, 35 contracts. Risk was 78.75. Your risk should be the same or close to the same on almost every trade, just so you know. Like, if you're done one contract, it would have cost you $225, okay? You can, you can take one contract, all right? You can take a beginner risk in an options account. Sold at 425, 
profit 7,000, return on investment 89%. Here's the chart, the Qs, closed here, gapped up. Again, this is December 1st, this was Monday, this is Tuesday in the morning, call these in the pre-market, boom, ran up, made new highs. Nice move, nice trade. Also called the SPY, the 366 calls expired 12-4. And again, this was a call. Cost was 225, number contracts 35, risk 78.75, sold 330, profit 3,675, return investment 47%. Again, take it, get out. Take it, book it, take it, book it, take it, book it. You gotta book money in December. You gotta book money when you're in trades, especially if you have a lot of things on, especially if you're taking the trades uh, with the market. This closed here on Monday, gapped up here on Tuesday, ran up, boom. Again, made new highs. And the Zoom was a put. This was earnings from Monday night. I called the 440 strikes. This crashed in the morning. It ended up opening way under 440. Called this in the morning around 835. Expired 12.4. Again, this was a put. Cost was not cheap if you did the 440s, but you could have done one farther away. Uh, would have been cheaper. 27 was the cost. Three contracts. Risk 8,100. Sold at 40. 3,900, return investment 48%. Nice trade. Here's the zoom. Closed here, gap down, fell, dropped, boom. And again, this expires Friday, so you could have exited here, but if you held it here this morning, this gap down again today. Called the 410 zooms, and later in the morning, once I saw it was running, gonna hit through the number, go to it, continue at 1032. Again, this was a put, zoom was a short. Cost was 1025, contracts eight, risk 8200, sold at 17, profit 50 per 100, return on investment 66%. Again, the same Zoom. So I call this a little bit later. Sometimes I'll do that. A lot of trades are in the morning, but sometimes I will come call some during the day as the day goes on once I see something's gonna continue or go to a bigger target. In the morning at 904, I called Apple, strike was 121, this was calls. Again, bullish move with the market, this was cheap, a buck 60. 50 contracts, risk was 8,000, sold at three, profit 7,000, return on investment 88%. Everybody loves to trade Apple, it's fun. Closed here, rallied. Closed here, gapped up, rallied. So this was December 1st there, Tuesday. This was Monday. I actually saw that Monday, but it was too late to do it Monday. So again, this is just one day of trades. Um, so, you know, everybody, made money yesterday as long as they booked the profits. Uh, you could still be in some things if you want, but you have to chunk it out. When you have a day where I'm calling two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten 10 trades, uh, there's been days I've called way more than that sometimes. Um, you, know, I, I, you know, sometimes I can spread them out if we get different ones different days, but at the end of the day, if I see seven things or 10 things or whatever, I'm gonna call them. It's up to you if you wanna do them all, but if you do, you can have a huge day, which is exactly what yesterday was. So it's Cyber Week. I'm running sales through Friday, December 4th. Great deals here, 20% off pretty much everything. 20% off the class if you want to learn my method. This is a bearish class. Normal price, $69.99. Sale price, 20% off, $55.99.20. Same thing with the bullish course. Okay, we do longs and shorts. And then the Gap Options newsletter, normally $69.99 a year. You receive all the newsletters to your email. No prerequisites. Again, 20% off, 55 99 20 this is, this is just a steal of a price. And for the class, too. So these are running through Friday if you want to sign up. Keep in mind, 2020 is almost over. It's hard to believe. I think a lot of people will be very happy when 2020 is over. But, you know, you have to take away the positives. It was a huge year trading. I saw the market very clearly this year. People that were with me. Uh, learned a lot, and uh, it was really a year I don't think that anyone can say that they can forget. But if you want to start and join with me and start to get my calls or even learn my method, I only do gaps. I only trade one strategy. And for me, I think that's the reason that I'm successful. I have that focus. And one strategy is all you need to be successful in the market. You do not need a general overall broad-based view to make money. Tons of people have that, and they fail all the time. In fact, I think that's one of the biggest mistakes people make is they think they need to know all kinds of different things to do well or make money. That's not true. You have to do one thing and do it extremely well, and I've done that. It, I have a niche, okay? 
Learn how to read institutional money in price patterns and gaps, and you don't need to do anything else. Because if your reason for doing this is to make money, this will make you money, period, full stop. Even if you don't understand what I'm doing, um, you can if you can follow along. I read the price, I read the price action and gaps, I see movements ahead of time in charts in that gap, and that is called price forecasting. So how was I able to call you know, this, this trade here 904, half an hour before the market opened, or even any of the other ones I called at 8 a.m. I forecasted that those moves would happen, which they did on the day, an hour and a half before the open. How was I able to do that? Using my rating system. It's based on institutional money, buying and selling that comes in, in the gap. So for me, the knowledge is the focus, which is my golden gap rating system. You get the benefit, if you're in the trading room live with me, of getting the calls. And if you want to just do the options and you don't want to learn the system, you just sign up for the newsletter. You have to decide what you want. Do you want to learn it and do it? Or do you just want to take the trades? But ultimately, the rating system is the key for me. That is it. That is everything. It's the meat and potatoes of my system. It's a 26 point checklist and the last class for the year is December 12th and 13th. If you want to learn my method, I think it will help you trade better. I think you will gain a lot of conviction if you understand it and learn it. What I do, I get up in the morning, I rate the gap, I use the checklist and I go through it and I tally up the total. Anything that rates 20 points or more, I take it in the direction of the gap and you learn the points in the class. For me, when I started out trading, my focus was always making money. It's great to know a lot of things, broad-based knowledge, even fundamentals, people are into that. I'm not, but if that helps you, fine, but it's not gonna make you money. Taking the trade before the move happens with momentum, predicting the price action and predicting if it's gonna move up or down before that stock actually does it is how you will make money. And then you get in and then you get out. But you've got to look at it like a bigger picture. You learn first and then you do it. You can easily make back the cost of the course in a few trades or even one day like you just saw. However, the larger benefit is really learning this. You can use it for the rest of your life. I've been doing this for 12 years and year over year I get better and better and better and I've been increasing my risk. So think about your long-term goals. Uh, think about how you're gonna get there. Live in the present, but you have to keep your, goal, your eye on the future of what your goal is. If you want to trade for a living, if this is what you want to do, if you want to work from home, it's possible. You can learn from me. Again, I teach my method in a class, and I'm very focused on making money, and I think that's one of the benefits of being with me. I'm lucky that I get to work from home. I'm blessed in that sense because really during this year, 2020, um, you know, a lot of people have been forced to work at home, and it's not ideal for some uh, different types of jobs. For me, it's the same thing as that I always do. And I really enjoy working from home and I have a lot of freedom. So the Golden Gap system, which I teach, is a 26 point professional bearish gap rating system. The purpose of the system is to help you evaluate which gap to trade each morning using a checklist. This checklist tells you what to trade when and in what direction. The 26 point checklist predicts directional bias in the stock. That's how I'm able to call the trades like an hour, an hour and a half before the open and then they go. So the checklist is everything. You must take the Golden Gap course to learn this. Or you can sign up for the options newsletter and just get the trades. But if you want to learn the class, I'd say get in this month in December. Learn it. I'm running the cyber, cyber sale through the 4th. Okay. It's a great discount. Normal tuition is $69.99. Class is December 12th and 13th, 9 to 5. You can sign up till December 11th, but the discount ends the 4th. Okay. Class is online. You can be anywhere in the world and take it. And the combo where you do the trends class too, you save $500 will be Monday the 14th. The newsletter subscription, like I said, is $69.99 a year. If you sign up by Friday the 4th, you can get a huge discount on that. You can, you can sign up today and get the trades for tomorrow. Um, so really, education, trading, learning, going through the process, it's a gift for yourself. Uh, everybody's shopping for everybody else right now, but don't forget self-gifting. You want to keep your goals in mind. I have some big goals for myself for 2021. I'm already thinking about those. I'm looking to close out this year very, very strong. This week helped. Yesterday was a great day, and we'll see where we go from here. If you'd like more information, again, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com, and stay safe, everyone.